Glenville is not just a place that is nationally and statewide known for athletics, but we have so many great things going on here too, academically. Uh, we have small classes, so the teachers are able to develop a meaningful relationship with our students during our advisory program and there's an array of activities here for a student to get involved in. It's a learning environment, but we're all like a family, you know what I'm saying? So when you come in, you see the staff, or you see the security guards, you see the janitor, you see the cafeteria people, we're all together as one. There's so much love around, from the students to the teachers, especially in sports too. From football, to cheerleading, to the chess team, to the National Honor Society. We also have a partnership with the Neighborhood Leadership Institute as our uh, lead agency because we're an investment school and uh, we have a lot of outside resources that students can take advantage of as well as their families. Glenville teachers, we have a saying, you will not walk out our class if you have not learned nothing. They, our teachers care about us. They would not let us leave if we have not developed something, we have not learned something, because they all want the best for us. They won't let you fail. They will help you. If you're struggling on a subject, they will pull you to the side or talk to you after class or after school. My teachers and my peers, they would kind of bring you out of your comfort zone. Not very forcefully, but enough to get you to budge just a little bit. I started to learn social skills and, you know, communicating better, and it was just there. We try and let the students know through our monthly town hall meetings the kinds of activities and opportunities that they have available at their fingertips simply because I firmly believe that the more exposure we can give our students then the more uh, intelligent decisions they can make and um, you know move forward from there. So we try and, and just let everyone know that this is the place you want to be. I chose Glenville because I asked a qu my mother a question when I was seven years old. I asked her what a tarp letter was. She told me it was something that could be defeated. I'm like, oh, okay, cool, a tarp letter can't be defeated. So I looked at what a tarp letter was. It said Glenville High School. So I said, oh, Glenville High School can't be defeated. So that's my, ever since I was seven, I wanted to come to Glenville High School. Come, just come, <laughs> come, 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 come. Just even if it's just to look, just to see what's going on, just to see if it's where you want to be in high school. It never hurts just to see. Just come. We'll gladly appreciate it. You'll be welcome. <laughs>